Kimberly Mazzilli with Vertimed. Vertimed is a Swiss-based company that is, specializes in surgical simulators. And what I have in front of me here is our new transvaginal ultrasound, obstetric ultrasound simulator. As you can see here, we have combined rubber models with high fidelity simulation. What I'm demonstrating here is actually a case within our transvaginal obstetric ultrasound simulation where you see a patient who has a double ectopic pregnancy. This will allow a sonographer to practice uh, recognizing the signs of a uh, not normal pregnancy so that they can uh, progress through the pregnancy and document the pregnancy for the doctor. We also have measuring tools here that allow the sonographer to work on their fine motor skills and which involves, as most sonographers know, trying to get the fetus, the embryo here in its longest plane for a crown rump length measurement. I'm going to freeze that. In the real practice, you would do three of these and take the middle value. But here's my crown rump length, eight weeks and two days. I'm gonna save that. In this case, there's also another measurement that a sonographer would do, and that would be a gestational, vol just a gestational sac volume for this empty sac here. Our simulator allows the sonographers to practice this in a risk-free environment and also, and a lot of times, sonographers don't have access to pregnant patients and when they do, you want to respect the rules of Alara by not exposing that baby over and over again to ultrasound scans that are unnecessary. So in this case, we allow the sonographers to practice their measurement and their scanning skills in a risk-free environment. The great thing about this tool for not just sonographers to practice their skills, but it's also great for instructors. Because at the end of the exam, when I hit complete, and I have gone through all of the steps that it has asked me to do and all of the measurements it's asked me to take, it's gonna ask me a series of questions so that I have to certify whether I have seen things for the doctor to check. I saw a fetus, I saw multiple. Was it intrauterine? No, it was not. It was outside the uterus. I did see cardiac activity in one of the fetuses did see a yolk sac in one. It asks you to go through nexa masses, free fluid in the cul-de-sac, and it's also going to allow me now to pick the best images that I want to keep, delete the others and save. I can check my answers. I can submit, and this reporting tool gives the instructors a nice view of my progress. Most sonography classes can be anywhere from 12 to 15 students, and a sonography a doctor doesn't have the time to spend with each student every day. This allows the instructor to go back later at a later date and actually view a video recording of the, of the scan. Um, it also scores you and your instructor can set courses for you to, that, are, that are basically customized for you and you have to pass with an 85% before it will let you go into the next case. So the instructors can really be the ones that set the pace. Um, and they have all of this access online. They can go and view the reports later from the comfort of their home if they want to. And then they can help uh, customize training for each individual student on the areas that they're struggling in instead of focusing on areas that they might already have mastered.